So, today's the day we go back in the water. My cast came off my wrist yesterday. It's still very weak. I've got to do exercises, so I've got to sort of try and strengthen the tendl tendons in it. And I'm not supposed to use a screwdriver with it or anything like that. But there's still an awful lot to do to get this boat ready to go in the water. So, P brackets on, uh, prop shaft is on. It's all anti-fouled. Um, I've just got the anchor chain to bring in and the dinghy to get on board and that's all the outside done but the inside is a tip and if I show you here you can see it's just a complete mess. So I've got to get this ship shape, get power tools put away get stuff put back into the rear cabin, get all of that lot cleaned out so I can put everything back properly. Um, but thankfully today is the first day since I fell that I'm not actually feeling any pain in my back, which is um, absolutely amazing. Um, I slept on the boat last night for the first time since the accident as well, and I think the mattress that we've got helped hugely because I was asleep as soon as my head touched the pillow so uh, and I didn't actually move or wake up until first thing well seven o'clock this morning uh, so I've been down out at seven done the prop anti-foul the second coat got the anode on for the P bracket got the anode on for the shaft which I'll show you in a second and um, yeah so it's now about 20 past 8, just got my first cup of tea, so I'm going to have that and then uh, crack on. <laughs> Hi there, we're Andy and Svetlana. In the summer of 2021 we packed our dogs in the car and uh, made our way to Greece to start our new life as liverboards on a sailboat. This is our journey, I hope you enjoy it and please like and subscribe. I may have spoken a bit too soon on the pain front. Uh, it's starting to kick in again now. But I've got all the tools in from downstairs apart from the sandpaper. I've got the storm anchor back in the anchor locker and the anchor raised and that's in. I've got the second coat of anti foul on, I've got the anodes on and I'm starting. So that cabin this cabinet's put back together. I just need to put the doors on it. The, the washing machine's back in its cupboard and that's all finished so I just need to tidy up in there. A bit of cleaning in the galley uh, and I'm starting to put tools away. So most of the tools have gone away now. I've got to get all of this lot out so I can put this back under the bed, the ladder's got to go in there, charts, blah blah blah, yeah, we're getting there. I never worked too hard, I worked easy. Ta da! Mm -hmm. Water to come away. Anywhere. See, you've got to put your hands. The boat. I'm not sure what to say about that. Right, my socks are getting uh, too full. I need to change the socks now, I think. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
Okay. Thank you very much. Now might be a good time to hit the thumbs up button if you could. Uh, it really helps the YouTube al algorithm which in turn helps our channel and it doesn't cost anything so I would much appreciate it. Last time, I am not on board because I'm taking the car around. Ready. We'll see. Check and start. Bravo. Yeah. Check, your, check, check inside and start engine, please. Okay.
I think so. Yeah. Okay, let me just turn the instruments on. Okay. Yep. Okay, you are off. Okay. such a lot of stuff to get on board from the apartment we've arranged to go to Limonaki Pontoon for a few days it's 20 euros a night including power and water um, but before we do I uh, have to go to anchor whilst my money gets there and of course I fall down the anchor locker which didn't do my back or my arm any good whatsoever Half past four in the morning. Where are you? Oh. What the heck are you doing? Got nails. So it just Haters. So, what's he trying to do? 
Huh? He was trying to raise his anchor and he caught, he caught the uh, lazy line. Uh, well, why was his anchor here? He caught his anchor on the lazy lines and his boat was going around like this. Okay. He caught our anchor. Why was he an his anchor here, near the pontoon? It wasn't. It was attached to a chain. Where? So he was at anchor? Then he yes, he was at anchor over there. And when he raised his anchor, he brought the chain up to the... There's no anchorage around here. I don't understand. He was way out there. I don't know what hell he would do with this boat. That's my question. Well, if he picked up a, he picked up a chain... That's my question. Why, why... It's, he was here, there's no anchorage here. He picked up a chain. I don't know how he managed to get all the way over here. But presumably he's trying to get this... Now oh, this time of the night, that's not fun. Something you don't see every day. Yeah. Svetlana, well outside her comfort zone. Really? Yeah. This is sailing is, as we say, uh, people think it's martini bikini. No, it's gin tonic. Actually, <laughs> but actually, yes, the boat is in yeah. chaos. It's so everywhere. dusty from the um, yard. And, and also uh, it's all mouldy yeah. after the winter. And then all the and stuff. Done. Let's come and messy all the stuff from the um, apartment. Delok, Delok. Yeah. Watch, watch, last watch. Last watch. She's demanding attention. Yeah. So, yes. Uh, and uh, so I've done this one uh, before, I remember. Mm -hmm. When I, I've done, went to the lockers, cleaned everything. Yeah. And put, put stuff in the lockers. Now, I'm not sure why as well because you've been there, haven't you? Yeah. No. Did you take anything out of the side lockers? No. No. When we, uh, you mean when, when we repair, repair? Uh, um, the first locker I emptied, but that had that had um, engine drive belts and well, the stuff electric that you're gonna need, reel yeah. so and electric cables. So the, other is the others, that. the others, I haven't touched. Yeah. But I had well, to take that one apart to get to, to the yeah. uh, bracket. So, yes, and... So today is everything, because we've brought everything from the apartment. So, so we're now trying to yeah. squeeze a, pot, a quart into a pint pot. Yeah. So, yes. This position, for a few hours already. Well, this shelf is clean. This locker is clean. It's just this vegetable locker is a bit, bit, bit dirty, stringy. Yeah. And uh, uh, then, yeah, I put everything you want. Okay. I can see you're participating with a glass of wine. Well, I'm, I'm doing my physiotherapy with my broken wrist. Yeah, yeah. This, yeah, is, this, yeah. Is, this is my physiotherapy. Lifting <laughs> yeah. the glass. Lifting the glass, yeah. Well, after last night, you need another yeah. plaster again. Probably look what I found. Yeah. Coffee. Mm. Yeah. Wasn't it in there? No, it was in this locker for some reason. All right, okay, so we've got more coffee. Good. Yes. That's all right. Yeah. So, what, what time was that? It was half past four in the morning or something. Half past four, yeah. Yeah. Sleepy. Sleepy, yeah. peacefully, minding our, our business. You see, the, the sleep of a sailor is never deep and uh, <coughs> a 
had this chair and, and she's oh. a Sadie in Russia. Is a um right. Anyway, it's not deep and there's not Because half past four, I was like, something's just knocked on a boat. Yeah. I was like, shit, what? What? Yeah. So, but my my wrist is swollen today because I had to go out in the dinghy at half past four in the morning so we jumped, to help we him get his anchor bed, off the chain. The cockpit, and there's yeah. a boat. I don't know where, how. I couldn't understand what he was doing here. There's no anchorage around, and so he caught a chain. Um, he caught the chain that's actually fastening the pontoons to the um, how seabed. How did he manage that? That's, that's I, 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 The only thing I, I can think, think of is he dragged, because that boat was okay. about 30 metres out in the bay. Yeah. So the only thing I can think of is that somehow he dragged... Okay, and he woke up because he banged into our boat. Oh, I'm, I'm just really curious what happened. Yeah, well, so am I because the boat, me. when we actually got up, the boat was facing the opposite direction. It was facing away from us. So the bow, the bow was towards us, and the stern was away from us. Yeah. And it, and he was wrapped around that chain. So, the the stern must have been what hit us. It's the only way he could have done. Because of where the anchor was, go around in the daylight and yeah. check the sides yeah. and go and find him. <laughs> Actually, I'm really curious to find how he ended yeah. up here next to the pontoon. There's no anchorage, and I don't know for hmm. uh, for. But uh, no, trying to trying to get a chain off an anchor with a broken wrist or recently broken wrist uh, was not a clever idea, really. Anyway, no. never mind. It happened. Right, still okay. You shouldn't get him to jump on it. Thing, Are you alright, sweetie? Yeah. Look at that face. Look at that face. Yeah. Have you full of chicken? Yeah, the heck of it playing in the yeah. Full of chicken. Good girl, aren't you? Right. Right, should we let Mum crack on? Yeah.